Hey everyone, my name is Brandon and today we're going to be at Monkey Go and we're going to have a look at trail number one. I'll put the official name and I'll put the official name on the screen here. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're just going to do a quick preview. It's a green circle, so it's a fairly easy trail. Uh, there's not too many features or anything to worry about, but nonetheless, if you don't know what the trail's like, we'll have a quick look. So let's have a look at that trail. Number one, La Famille. As I mentioned, it's a green circle. It's a pretty short track. It's just a nice little loop. A theme in this place is a lot of roots and a lot of small rocks that are embedded into the trail. You should watch out for it. I could knock you off your bike fairly easy. There's a lot of uphill to this though, so you still need to have some physical endurance to get through this path, to get through this trail. Ooh, almost ate, ate cracked in. To get through this trail without being out of breath. Since I'm talking and riding, I'm out of breath already, man. So we'll stick to the right here. Stay on number one. There's a few rooty sections up here. There's some tight trees, followed by some rocks around the vicinity. So just choose your lines wisely, but they're, it's fairly easy to pick them. It's great for beginners. Overall, it is nice and flowy. A lot of pedaling involved, but There's not too many places you have to worry about. It's a couple of large rocks you can play around with. Again, more rocks sticking up. You should mind your, your front sprockets if they're fairly large. Some of these rocks are tough to get over without smacking them. A couple of rocks back there had some marks on them. Again, keep in mind about these large rocks. Sometimes they'll be like a small tree stump you have to keep an eye out for. They're not painted, unlike how they would be on a trail or on a during a race, usually, that I've seen. Not that I've been in any races, but just from videos I've seen. So it's good to keep an eye out. Another small rock garden, it looks like it's growing nicely. A couple little burns. This, uh, the direction I took this trail in I would recommend this direction, considering there is a, a small ramp near the end of this trail. So you can take your pick if you want to go up the ramp in the reverse side and get some nice flowy trail on the way back down. Or if you want to hit the ramp the way it should have been hit. You won't get much air anyway, but any jump is better than no jump in my books so here we'll stick to the left <clears throat> there's a couple small switchbacks you can maintain some speed you have to mind the rocks they blend in quite well Take this a bit wide. Here's the jump. You can get a lot of speed, so you should mind yourself. <clears throat> we'll stick to the left. A 
Again, watch for those rocks and this tight corner that we saw earlier. I almost wiped out from that rock that I just rolled over, so again, be careful with this one. It is for, I only mentioned to be careful so much because it's meant for beginners. <clears throat> so that's trail one. La famille.